what's up? It's Cooking with Chef Millie, the number one food trapper. You already know what it is. Today, I'm repping my kids, man. This is where we cook at when we do the cooking academy. So today, I'm going to rep my kids and I'm going to cook for y'all. So, we doing a tomahawk steak and we're going to add all this butter lump crab meat. That's it. We got five ingredients. So grab your ingredients and let's go. So, I let the butchers do all the work at Whole Foods today. Nice tomahawk steak. Let's see what we got. This is nice. This is a nice tomahawk steak. Nice eye. Nice ribeye. We're going to get busy with this. We're going to get straight to it, y'all. Because like I said, we got five ingredients. We got salt. We got pepper. We got crab meat. We got butter. And we got the steak. That's it. We getting straight to it. We going to stir this steak nice and hard just with salt and pepper and a bunch of butter. Then we're going to pop it in the oven with more butter at 500 degrees. So we're going to get a lot of heat in there, a lot of heat, and then we're going to take it out and let it finish with residual heat. That way it'll be nice and juicy and we won't overcook it. Then we're going to take our crab meat and we're going to warm that up with a bunch of butter and add just a little bit of salt. I might add some pepper just so I can give it a little bit more kick to it. But boom, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have a steak and we're gonna have a bunch of crab meat. So let's go. So we wanna season high and get this salt and pepper all over this steak. Even the bone, put some salt on the bone, why not? Every last part. market don't be afraid to grab one so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab me a nice chunk of butter a nice chunk of butter like I said we're gonna use a lot of butter we're gonna try to keep it at a pound a day just one pound not too much make sure your griddle is nice and hot because you're about to sit a big tomahawk steak on there so like I said we're gonna take our Nice big tomahawk and just sit it right on the butter. So listen, let your steak sear. Don't get scared. Get a nice good crust on this steak. Let your butter get brown. If you get a little bit scared, add some more cold butter and then it'll just cool it right down a little bit. But you want to get it nice and brown, a nice hard sear, because that's how it's going to lock those juices in, y'all. But you need a nice hard sear if you're going to do this time of steak at home. steak so we're gonna go in the oven like I said 500 degrees we're gonna take our steak 
You like what? What you think? More butter. Yup, more butter. I'm gonna put butter on the bottom of the steak, and guess what? I'm gonna put butter on the top of the steak. Boom, so we're gonna put some butter on top of that steak, and we're gonna straighten the oven. gonna warm our crab up. Like I said, straight butter and crab, that's it. A little bit of salt and pepper just to bring the flavor out, but that's it. Butter, a little bit more. It's a crab. Pull that out and let the residual heat catch it up to where I wanted to get to. So I'm at about medium rare, you know, just a little over rare. That's where I like my steak at. I've been warming up, warming up my butter at the same time. So let me go ahead and check my steak. tomahawk steak at home it was a little challenge we got it done we got our crab meat warmed up it's a great dish so we're gonna go ahead and dig in but like i said in the beginning i was doing this one for my kids man i wanted to show them that i'm gonna cook right where y'all be cooking at so y'all check that link in my bio y'all checking it down here in the comments please click the link watch our video and we just want to share the message you feel me donating to us is sharing the message that's all it is so y'all keep subscribing, y'all keep clicking the bell, y'all keep liking, y'all keep commenting. I appreciate it. Y'all already know what it is, man. I love y'all. So keep doing all the YouTube stuff. It's Chef Millie, the number one food trapper. It's Chef Millie, the cooking academy. So y'all already know what it is, man. Keep supporting. Bang, I'm out.